today I'm doing another Shop Miss A haul, and if you're wondering about the um, background slash the lighting, um, I'm just playing around right now. Um, I'm at home, I'm not at school right now because it's winter break, so I thought I would just play around with studio lighting and studio backdrop, whatever. <laughs> and so I know there's like a shadow behind me and I should have like a light on this side, but we're just gonna work with what I have. And yeah, so let's just dig in. I'd say I've done oh, two other hauls on the channel before, and um, sorry for my nails, but people really like them, so I decided to do a bit more. Also, I just, if you're wondering about the makeup and the outfit, I just filmed, I mean, not filmed, a, I, ugh, I took some outfit, outfit pictures for my blog, so those will be up soon if you want to go and check them out. Um, I'll link my vlog and my Instagram down below. So to start off our haul, I'm going to start off with the eyelashes. Because I always get a ton of eyelashes every time I order from Shop Miss A. Obviously because all their eyelashes are a dollar and it's a good price. So um, this time I decided to get single eyelashes. Um, so I have, let's see, here are the short ones. It's going to be like an amazing amount of glare. There we go. Those are short. Um, and then I have medium, and then long, obviously. I'm not going to show them all, but yeah, those are those. Those are just individual eyelashes, and they're helpful if I want to do makeup on other people and not use strip lashes. I also got number 99 for the full strips. Um, I got with the wispy lashes. Um, and, oh, I'm wearing number twos, and I really like these. These are, like, flared out. They're, like, super dramatic and flared out at the ends. So they give a very caddish look. Those are number twos. Those are also Cara. And, um, I have 41s from Cara. So I wanted the clean color 41s because they looked super good, but those were out of stock. So I was like, eh, I'll just try the, um, Cara. So got one bottom lash, and it's just the clean color angelic wink in the style 75 that's that okay I'm, I'm gonna tackle the non makeup stuff first which is pretty much this is the only item I kind of feel weird about showing this on camera but they do sell like panties and this is cute so that's the only one I got though we're actually um, septums and I'm really excited about these I was really excited to see them on there because I've always wanted a fake septum just just you know to like try it out so I got quite a few eyeliners this time um, oh I got the brow pencil by clean color um, and I got it in the say shade silver or charcoal I think charcoal um, I have black hair right now so I still have my dark brown eye, um, eyebrows but I may do, I've always wanted to do like a gray, gray hair, so if that happens then I'll use this charcoal pencil for my eyebrows so it doesn't have like that warm tone in it. But right now there's sort of like a cool tone. These and the only two colors they had which were orange and yellow. Um, I haven't really tried these out yet so I can't tell you how they are. I know that the pencil part on the orange one already, so it just fell out right now. It comes with a pencil part, like a crayon part, and then a liquid liner part on the bottom. So um, the pencil part is probably not going to work for me, but the liquid liner seems to stay really well. I swatched it on my hand, and it wasn't super opaque, but it like stuck there until it like flaked off later. I also got um, these three LA Color Jumbo Pencils. And I got them in Pool Party, which is this aqua blue. Um, uh, what is this one called? Bronze Shimmer, which is like this gold color, and Bikini Time, which is this sort of duochrome purple and blue, and I'll swatch them on the back of my hand. So Bikini Time is a little bit less pigmented than the other two. Um, in all, I think they're very similar to the NYX Jumbo Pencils, which is why I got them, because I do like the, the NYX Jumbo Pencils, and I don't know. Pool Party is definitely the most pigmented out of all of them. 
So I got, I have, if you saw my previous haul, which I'll link probably on the video somewhere, um, I bought quite a few of these, maybe like five, and I got one more. Um, I do think that these are drying, I wouldn't like wear them out for like an entire day, like I don't think it'll last that long, but they're like fun for colors and like for photos, but I got this in the shade Mai Tai, and it's just a really, really, really light orange color. I thought it was pretty cool. So it's like I got another one previously that was Canyon that was like an orange red, but this is an actual orange color, and they do smell really good. Got this Amuse Summer Glow Body and Face Bronzer, and it's just like a shimmer bronzer. Um, I was debating whether or not to get this on my last haul, but then um, I went back and I watched a Emily Noel video. Um, and she hauled this and she said that they were like creamy consistency and that they were interesting so I was like oh, I have to get that and they're not super pigmented so they're here um, but they do show up and I can probably use it for eyeshadow oh, that I'm really digging it's really really cute um, and I'm really liking how it looks with the studio lights is the clean color spotlight blush this one's in the shade Sable, 03 Sable, and basically it's just a really, really nice peachy shade, and on the inside there's like a mirror and a brush, which I won't use, but it's really cute, and I like the shade a lot. I also got a brow brush. Um, I have like a million of these, but I got this one for my sister, um, and it's the Giovi Magic Finish Baked Eyeshadows in number two and four. So they have four of these on the website, and two of them are greenish colored, but these two are like peachy champagne shades. So um, I would use these as highlights. Pressed powder, because I go through my face powders very fast, because I like matte looks. So usually every time I put on foundation, I put a powder over it. So I just grabbed this. I haven't tried it out yet, but um, actually I've swatched it, and it just seems to provide quite a bit of coverage and so I guess I'll try it out and if I like it then I'll repurchase it because it was only a dollar and that's a pretty good price for a face powder considering that I go through mine very fast. So I also got four of these starry blushes and um, these two are the same color and I think they gave me the wrong ones that I ordered in the same color. I think I ordered two of these so I have to look into that and email them because I was like meaning to give one of them for a gift. But yeah, so I got these four and I have I'm I have the fourth one, so they have four different colors. I have the fourth one already, um, that you can see in my last haul, and um, I really liked it, so I decided to get them the rest of the colors plus get one for someone. So. I also got this Amuse Perfect Duo and um, it's just like a little six eyeshadow sort of thing and I don't know I was really attracted to the red shade and the aqua shade or like the turquoise shade so they're not that pigmented though so I'm like they're like not bad but they're not the most pigmented shadows ever that I've gotten from Shop and Say so they're okay so got this which is the clean color tanned roar bronzer and um, this is in Waikiki ma Matte. Um, I, the other color I really want is Bally Matte, but they were sold out. Um, so I got this one. I'm probably going to give it to my sister. Cause it's the darkest out of the shades, and I don't think it's that pigmented. Well, I'm, here's what I'm going to say. Um, I don't believe in like super pigmented bronzers, because I think you should be able to build it up. So that's why I really like this. I think it's, I'm going to like swatch it give it to my sister, but I'm like, I'm gonna swatch it anyway, for the sake of video, right? Am I right, friends? Yeah, I am. <laughs> it's right here. So it's a really nice brown shade, and I almost don't want to give it to her, because it's a, I mean, I feel like I, I can wear it, and for a dollar, I think this is awesome. And last but not least, I got this LA Colors Single Eyeshadow Pot in the color Terracotta, and Oh my gosh, I really like this. It's 
very pigmented and I'm wearing it on my eyes right now. Oh, I forgot to tell you, I'm wearing the, um, what is it? The uh, baked eyeshadow highlight that I talked about earlier and it's in my, on my cheekbones right now over the spotlight blush and it is really pigmented so I do like it. Anyway, but that's not the point. This is in terracotta and it's such a pretty color so it's on my eyes right now and I'm going to swatch it for you. Super pigmented. Right there. I'm like in love with this color. I use a lot of like terracotta clay colors so I'm really glad I picked this one up and it's much better than the LA Colors eyeshadow um, ugh, eyeshadow palette ones where they come in like five colors. The quality of this one is a lot better so I'm glad that I ordered it. So that's all I ordered from Shop Masse. so thank you so much and um, be sure to subscribe, like, and um, comment down below what videos you want to see from me and Caitlin. Uh, we're on winter break right now, so I'm like trying to film as much as I can so I can like edit it and get it up and have more videos for you continuously instead of going like a long break without videos. Um, and it's a lot harder to film videos when I'm in school and I have class. So yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this and I hope you like the lighting. Unfortunately, um, I'm probably going to shoot like a makeup tutorial with this lighting um, sometime, but I don't think I won't have it when I go back to school, so it'll be back to like old, my like crazy Halloween room background. But for now, I hope you enjoyed. Thanks so much, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.